Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I have another video for you. A side-by-side -side comparison between the Adidas Yeezy 350 V2 Beluga Reflective and the Adidas Yeezy 350 V2 Carbon Beluga. If you want to see the full review of the Beluga Reflective, click on the left side of this video. And if you want to see the full review for the Carbon Beluga, click on the right side on the square in front of you. So guys, let's not wait any longer and let's compare those two babies. So guys, I've made this video for the ones that do not know which one they prefer and which one they would like to wear. So guys, if you are in this case, that's the video for you. I'm gonna compare them side by side. I'm gonna take the Beluga Reflective out and the Carbon Beluga out and I'm gonna put them side by side so you can make your choice, guys. You can take a decision between the one you prefer. So guys, I have a brand new Carbon Beluga I'm going to unbox it right now. So now that we have unboxed this baby, guys, stay tuned until the end of the video. At the end, I'm going to help you with the sizing. I'm going to tell you and help you to choose which size you should go to for your Yeezy 350 V2. So guys, on the left side, we have the Beluga Reflective on size 9 UK, 9.5 US. And guys, we all know the beautiful silhouette of the Beluga Reflective. This is the original colorway made by Kanye, guys. It's a banger. I have my flashlight on so you can see some of the reflective effects on the shoe. So guys, now we've seen this one. Let's go right away on the Carbon Beluga. And yes, guys, another bank with the carbon beluga. You can see the reflective laces, guys. The beautiful orange strip, the dark sole. I really like the shoe, guys. And this is why I've made this video because I know you like the both as well. So now we have them side by side. We can actually see which one we prefer. I have now a size 10 UK so guys let's keep it up and let's have a look at them side by side so guys let's turn off the flashlight so we can see them without the reflective effect three two one Guys, we are on the road of 1,000 subscribers. If you want more Adidas, more Yeezys, more Nikes, more Jordans, that's the channel for you. Please give me the love and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Let's go to 1,000 subscribers. I will give you more shoes, guys.
guys, now that you saw them next to each other, let me know which one you prefer. Let's put back the reflective effect. 3, 2, 1. Boom, guys, it's like magic. I like this picture, guys. Imagine you are in the club with all the lights there is, guys, and boom, your shoes are reflective. Wow, I really like this feature on both shoes. guys you can clearly see the difference in the reflective effect on both shoes on the carbon beluga you got the reflective on the laces and the back heel and on the reflective one you got the reflective effect on all the shoes but not on the laces guys so guys in order to give you a better side-by-side -side comparison i'm gonna take out the size 10 carbon beluga because the reflective is size 9, I'm going to put a size 9 carbon beluga. So they are the same size and we can clearly see which one is the best. Guys, my channel is there for you to see the shoe before making your purchase decision and buying them and reviewing them so you can see the shoe before pulling the trigger. Okay guys, now that I've seen them side by side, one next to the other, I can actually give you my honest opinion on which one I prefer. Please, please don't beat me in the comments, but I prefer the Carbon Beluga. The reason why I prefer the Carbon Beluga, because of its carbon, you know, because it's darker than the other one, I know. and. Don't get me wrong, I love the reflective as well, guys. I just slightly before prefer the carbon because of the darker colorway. But both are good, guys. Both are amazing. Which, well, whatever you go for, it's gonna be good. But for all me, only for me, I prefer the carbon. Let me know which one you prefer in the comment, guys. Look at them. They almost identical guys just one is darker than the other one and the reflective effect are changed that's it I prefer the darker model talking about that guys let's talk about the sizing between the two so guys Adidas sent me two different sizing of the carbon beluga size 9 UK and size 10 UK so I could decide which one and give you an opinion on which one is the best for my for your sizing. My sizing guys is size 8, therefore I receive size 9, one size up, and size 10, two size up. And let me tell you, there's no need to go for size 10, two size up. One size up is enough. So if you are size 8 UK, go for size 9 UK. If you live in the US guys, your size is half size up therefore if you are size 9 us just just go for nine and a half guys and if you don't need to go ten and a half nine and a half is enough for you guys half a size up in the us and one full size up in the uk guys 
I hope everybody understood. I'm going to repeat it clearly. I am size 8 UK, which is a size 9 US. So the best shoe for me is the size 9. So one size up. If you live in the US, just go alpha size up, which is 9.5. Okay, pretty simple. Guys, thank you for watching. And I see you on my next video. Take care.